So it's feeding time. You see the puppies are doing a very good job of eating out of their bowls. Well, not their bowls, but they're eating out of dishes. And they're a little bit more active with each other. That's um, Henley playing with Apple. And if you look at his rear legs, he, uh, he's doing a much better job standing up on his rear legs. That egg crate foam really does a good job of giving a little additional support. And we want to make sure that he does get his legs under him. There is something that's known as swimmer syndrome. It's a much more extreme case than, uh, than what Henley has been going through. But if you don't pay attention and give them the support and strength that they need, swimmer syndrome can result and then their legs just splay out from under them and they wind up lying on their stomachs all the time, which is also not good for their bone development. So um, just to make positively sure that everything comes along nicely, we've been allowing Henley to walk on the egg crate foam and that has helped an awful lot. So they're eating, um, this is still the puppy moose, we, we're not ready to move on to softened kibble yet, but they're eating the moose very nicely, they like it, they're developing a taste for it, they don't have to prod them anymore, they go right to the dish and try to eat. This is their second meal of the day today. Now of course everybody else wants to get in, there's Jamba trying to get in because he remembers his puppy days and he remembers that puppy moose and how good it was. And there's Bootsy, the mother, and she knows that she can go in and clean up when they're all done. So she's anxious to get in, but I'm going to let the puppies eat as much as they possibly can. You know, Henley, you're not supposed to walk in there. I also have, I didn't have it down there because they were eating, but I have this toy that we hang. This is the first toy that they get to play with. And they've already, um, you can see, they're kind of bopping it with their noses and they, they learn to interact with toys that way and have a little bit of fun. And as they get older and develop more, we will provide different kinds of toys for them. There's also a soft toy there for them to chew on and you see Apple is over there doing that. Oh, and Henley is getting violent with the toy. What is it, Henley? Really? Summer is polishing off the last of the food in that dish, doing a good job of it. So as they finish up their second meal of the day, you can see they're developing very nicely and we will report back to you soon but I think now it's time to let Bootsy in to clean up the food <laughs> 